Hi friends and welcome to Victor's Reality. Today I have another new monitor reveal, the Aorus FV43U 4K monitor. Visa certified display HDR 1000 with a quantum dot display. This is the first quantum dot QLED panel I have on the channel with two HDMI ports, 97% of the DCI-P3 color coverage, and the amazing space audio that we will get to in future videos. This is the best set of speakers I have heard on any monitor and it sounds just as good as my Samsung Neo QLED Mini LED QN98 TV. This monitor packs a punch and has everything included. To be honest with you all, I was pleasantly surprised. My eyes were so surprised with gameplay and playing a whole bunch of different videos. The colors are popping on this monitor. I did not think I would be as surprised as I am right now. Up top on the screen, I do have the settings for this video. As you can see, it is in 4K, black equalizer at 10. You can get more contrast if you lower it a bit, but we have it here on 10. Aim stabilizer is on off. The overdrive is on picture quality. And of course, at 144 Hertz on the PC with adaptive sync on g-sync compatibility on this video is an sdr with 100 brightness 60 contrast as any higher does clip the whites 5 percent sharpness we have the gamma off for the specific video and color temperature on normal with movie preset across all these videos the menu system here is the same as my old aorus ad 27 qd monitor everything is the same and easy to navigate so i know what to expect but this black equalizer just like the gigabyte m28u is very strong and very handy if you want that added contrast of course the m28u is an ips and this is a va but they do help out the picture tremendously if that's what you're looking for now there are a couple of things right away off the bat that i can see with this monitor but we are just unveiling it today here we will get to many versus videos we will get to many in-depth videos on this monitor that nobody is reporting on youtube and of course i am always honest with you all and i want to make sure you make an awesome buying decision that aside i am so happy this is on the channel this will be now my main go-to monitor for everything except editing that crown still goes to the lg 27 gp 950 monitor as i am actually editing this video on it right now the lg nano ips displays srgb mode is the best of the best from all the monitors that i have on the channel right now and while the srgb mode here is fine and it works really well it doesn't give me the neutral neutrality of colors if that makes any sense and that's only on the LG that I can see so far from all my monitors that I have here but if I'm gonna be watching a movie if I'm gonna be playing a next generation game even old-school gaming I will do it on the Aorus FV43U I really didn't think this monitor was gonna be as good as it is right now what I'm seeing from my eyes I also was kind of skeptical saying man 43 inches versus 32 will it be too big I don't know if I'll be able to fit it on my desk I don't know if my eyes would get used to it but let me tell you rest assured Assured, this thing is beautiful it is a beauty and the main reason why I got this is because I wanted to see the difference between 43 inches versus a 32 you know I love my 32 inches I actually prefer 32 inches over 27 inches but that's my personal preference but now seeing 4k at 43 inches that's amazing currently there are two manufacturers that are doing 43 inches Asus and Aorus and I'm sure more monitors will be coming out in the 43 inch range and of course you can get a 48 inch OLED the LG C1 that many use as a monitor today and they love it they also make a 50 inch Samsung QN90A mini LED TV as many use that as a monitor also and breaking news overnight as I'm making this video Samsung just announced a 43 inch version of the Samsung QN90A Neo QLED mini LED TV 43 inches the same size as I'm showing you off right now so that is mini LED technology they just announced it and we still need to know the specifications if it does actually include the mini LED TV technology, but why would they call it a QN90A if it didn't? I will bring you that information as soon as I get it. And the 42 inch OLED LG C1 has been delayed until next year, early 2022. So that is something really interesting. High end TVs are turning into monitors as they are getting way better. And a 42 inch OLED would be amazing for a 43 inch Neo QLED. There are so many options for so many people. I know we're talking about the Aorus FV43U, but there are so many options and we need more competition to fight for that quality. 
because they're fighting for our dollars and we need the best of the best and I'm happy all four manufacturers, Asus, Aorus, Samsung and LG are trying to fight for the 42, 43 inch king of monitors. So hit that subscribe button if you do want to see more information on all those four panels, all those four manufacturers that will be here on Victor's Reality. This panel has two HDMI 2.1 ports for 4K 120Hz on your Xbox Series X, Xbox Series S, or PlayStation 5. Everything looks amazing. This audio, again, it's the best I've heard on any monitor by far. It's crazy good. And the vibrancy of this VA panel, it is a top-notch VA panel, of course, if you're sitting in front of it. And it's really hard to go back to a smaller size. I'm editing here on the LG, but it's really hard because I want to go back to the Aorus and start playing on it. Civilization 5, Doom Eternal, Call of Duty, Battlefield, Marvel vs. Capcom, Forza, Halo, everything looks amazing. And actually, I really want to play Halo 4 all over again on this monitor. I think I got a couple achievements that I still need to hammer out. But I'll bring that video to you very soon in the future. But again, friends, showcasing here the Aorus FV43U, it's here on the channel now. And we will be making many versus videos against all the monitors here. 43 versus 27, 43 versus 28, 32 versus 43, 25 versus 43, whatever, everything and anything. It's not about being fair. It's about showing you the difference so you can see in case you were wondering how it looked. How much better is this premium over this mid-tier panel? So you can make an awesome buying decision. The holidays are coming up and nobody wants to waste their money on trash. So friends, if you found this video helpful, please leave a like, share, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to turn on that notification bell so you never miss out on a future Aorus FV43U 4K Quantum Dot HDMI 2.1 display monitor. That's a, that's a really long sentence. I'll see you guys seconds. next time. Team George has been sacked. Teams remaining. It's getting spicy. You took out Team Abel. Careful there, you got under 10 lives left.